welcome to the corner of my problems. Well, one of my problem corners. Um, it looks really bright right now, especially with this east facing window really reflecting a lot of light over into that corner. However, in about an hour, it is about 2, 33 o'clock in Denver right now. So in about 30 minutes to an hour, this area over here is gonna get really dull looking and my plants I feel like need a little more light. So went and got some more lights and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to obviously move all of that stuff out of the way. Um, it is starting to creep into the living room but that's okay. Um, and then I'm going to use a closet rod, flip it this way so that I can attach one of those clip lights with a grow light in it so that they can get some additional lighting once the sun moves over into this side of the home because the two trees that are in the front, they really are blocking a lot of the sun. Before they start blooming, this whole living room stays uber bright, probably till like four or five o'clock in the afternoon. But once they fill in, this is kind of where we are. So I want to give the girls in the corner as much light as possible during their growing season. And of course, once the dull days come, I want to be able to have that up as well. So let's get started. Um, as you can see, there is no rod there. It doesn't work out for me. For now, I've just clipped the light to the curtain rod up here and have it facing towards these plants over here, which if you look right here, I used one of the wall planters and put in the spider wart and that right there is a type of peperomia. I don't know the name of it. I have the tag over there, but so they will get a little more light. But if I stand back just a wee bit, it's not quite as bright as you can see. There's no glare. You can actually look out the window now. And then I went ahead and put another one on this side. Again, I'll have to get something to kind of hold those wires up against the wall so they're kind of hidden. But for now, it worked. And I just want to show you guys real quick this beautiful cyclamen that I know they're out of season. Look at her. I'm pretty much getting into a lot of the lacy blooms lately with my lacy African violets. And then I saw her and got this little lacy girl and look at all the blooms yet to come. Yay. And then just a quick look at the Pilea peperomia. Look at all the babies growing in there. That is amazing. And then we are propagating some of the, I think it's a syndapsis. Maybe, I don't know. Anyway, it's a type of IV, I think. So, all right, well guys, if you have any ideas on what I can do to put something in that corner, because I'd really like that light to hang down, um, kind of facing the living room instead of it being right there, just because I think it's gonna be too much light for that snake plant that's already kind of pale because she was getting too much light at my aunt's house, I think, since I just repotted her. But I want it a little more evenly distributed kind of across this way so that these girls here also get some additional light. Oh, and look who decided to open her blooms. Little Miss Soft Cloud. Anyway, guys, hope you have a great day. And again, if you have any ideas on how I can get a light in that corner, much appreciated. 